Welcome to How to Create Art with Arrows. Here are the materials you'll need. Okay, these are temper paints. They're pretty water soluble, so I can use these water balloons and put a little bit in there and fill it up with water and shake it up and mix it so then you have more paint even if you just have this little bottle. Make sure you have enough supplies to clean up. This is a little bit of a messy class. For a watercolor effect, Start with 1 4th paint and 3 4th water. This will tone down the pigmentation compared to normal tempera paint. The more water you use, the less pigment you will get on your canvas. So keep that in mind as you begin to fill your balloons. Here we used 1 half water and 1 half paint. As you can see, it leaves a lot more pigment on the canvas, and people seem to enjoy it a lot more. We hung our water balloons with a mixture of fishing line and masking tape, although twine and paracord work too. We started our participants at 7 yards. Keep in mind that these are small targets, so if it takes a couple arrows to hit one, that's perfectly fine. experienced or have smaller balloons, you can move them up to five yards. The end result should be abstract style paintings that are handmade and anyone should love to have in their home. Make sure if you try this to tag us on social media 